Maristela Torres Sunang leapt to a ninth place finish in what could be her last Asian Games, and Eric Sean Cray fumbled in the men's 400 meter hurdles on Monday night at the Jalora Bunkarko Main Stadium. Sunang, who at 37 was the oldest in the 11 woman field in women's long jump, leapt to a distance of 6. 15 meters distance, which was only good for ninth place. All her rivals were also at least nine years her junior. Vietnam's Thu Thu Tau Bui, 26, won the gold with a leap of 6.55 meters. India's Nina Verical, 28, took the silver with 6. 51 and China's Zhu Xiaoling, also 26, settling for the bronze with 6.50. Cray, who at 29 was also the oldest in his event's final placed seventh against a world-class field. The Phil American clocked 51.53, which was even slower than his 50.54 in the semifinals. The top five finishers of the 400 meters hurdles all broke the 50-second barrier with Qatar Zabderam and Samba clocking 47. 66 that shattered the 16-year-old AC at mark of 48.42 by Al Sameli has during the 2002 Busan Games. The long-limbed Samba, who was born in Mauritania, but shifted allegiance to Qatar and became eligible to compete for his adopted country in May 2016, was also the second fastest 400 meters hurdler ever and the second person to run the 400 meters hurdles in less than 47 seconds with his 46. 98 at the Diamond League in Paris Saint Denis France early this year. India's Dharana Yasami placed runner up in the Asian 400 meters with a 48. 96, while Japan's Abe Takatashi ranked third with a 49.12 clocking. Cray, a two time 400 meters hurdles champion of the SEA Games, Myanmar and Singapore, will again try his luck in the 4x100 with Anthony Lapina, Clayton Bautista, and Trenton Barham on Thursday. Barham and fellow Phil American Christina Knott joins the 200 meters on Wednesday. On Friday, Ejabiana plunges into action in the men's pole vault.